Hey now. Hey now. Jack Mofino on our name. Hey now. Giacomo Fino Anane, Anane. It's nobody, she said, looking at her vibrating phone. Or no one. <laughs> nobody or no one. But it's always somebody. Even if she didn't recognize the name on the screen. So long as you take into account automated calls, robo calls, recorded calls. She didn't mean that it was somebody or someone in particular. She couldn't have meant that, didn't mean that, didn't mean that she didn't know who was calling, because if she didn't know the name or number, she would have said, most likely would have said, I don't know this, or do you recognize this name or number? She would have said most likely, conceitedly, not definitely, but she said nobody or no one. Suddenly, reactively, as if she was startled by the call, caught off guard, perhaps even embarrassed. Nobody or no one, whomever, someone she knows well enough so that her disingenuous attempts cannot preclude him from disrupting our wavering connection. See that lady dressed in red? Ike, Ike, Ante. Dollars, she shoot you dead. See that lady dressed in green? Ike, Ante. She's a lady, she's a love machine. Mofinane. See that lady dressed in gray. I go, I go, I go. You never hear anything I say. See that lady dressed in blue. I go, I go, Ante. I love her, but she loves you. It would be appropriate, don't you agree? <laughs> if we sat together on a sliver of the moon. Our legs dangling over the side, swinging back and forth in space. Leaning back just enough to grasp the edge. Laughing as the crumbs from the pumpkin muffins you baked and brought alone float away. Sitting close to one another, but not too close. Not suggestively close, but close enough. So that one of us could reach out that the other started to slide off, forward or backwards, which could happen because the slope is slippery and narrow, and it is easy to lose focus, to lose poise, to lose balance. Could reach out with that simple, tender touch that replenishes hope.